Hi, my name is Chip Brown. I teach computer programming and Microsoft Office applications at Stephen Seneger College here in Utah. I also create practice tests for Microsoft Office certifications. Today we're going to learn how to define a many-to-many -many relationship in Microsoft Office Access 2007. Microsoft Access is a registered trademark of Microsoft Corporation. I am not affiliated with Microsoft Corporation. To edit many-to-many -many relationships, it is important that we first understand how to view relationships in a Microsoft Access database. Using this sample database, we'll go into Database Tools and then in the Show Hide group, we'll click on Relationships. This displays all the relationships that have been set up between the tables in this sample database. Each of these squares represents a table with the fields. The key icon represents the primary key. The relationship is represented by the dark black line. The number one means that there is one table, one record in this table for every, and the infinity sign means many for many records in the orders table. It also means that all the orders have one and only one customer associated with it. In other words, customers have many orders, and each order belongs to one customer. This is a one-to-many relationship. To create a many-to-many -many relationship, we have the situation that exists here between the employees table and privileges table. Employees have many privileges. Each privilege is mapped to one or more employees. To solve this many-to-many -many relationship, we introduce a new table, and we can name it by the names of the two tables that it is the uh, join table for. The relationships that exist are a one-to-many and a many to one. Here we have two key fields. One is the key field for the employee ID and the other is the key field for the privileges. All the records here would indicate the relationships that exist between employees and privileges. Each entry in this would indicate be done for a particular employee and a particular privilege. This is how we create a many-to-many -many relationship. If you double-click on the relationship, it brings up the Edit Relationships dialog. This is where you would choose the table and the field and the related table and its field. Likewise, table, the ID, other table, and its ID. This is how you create a many-to-many -many relationship. For more information or videos, visit me, Chip Brown, at chipbrown.com. That's brown with an E.